Movie theaters are starting to reopen with new social distancing policies. Tonight, Fox News' Patrick Clark takes a look at B&B theaters' plans and ways that they are keeping their visitors safe. The National Association of Movie Theater Owners putting together a comprehensive plan for this next phase opening of select movie theaters like this B&B Wildwood location here. They're getting ready for the first new film on the big screen since March. Movie theaters and studios partnering together, promising safe standards and continuous cleaning of theater seats after each show. There's a new initiative called Cinema Safe. Uh, it's some 300 movie theater companies across the country um, representing over 3,000 screens that have partnered with yeah, doctors and epidemiologists as, as well as our trade organization to roll out these new protocols. Russell Crowe's new movie, movie Unhinged, the first film to debut on a big screen since March. It opens at B&B Festus, Wildwood and Wentzville, as well as the AMC and Marcus St. Charles movie theaters. Guests and employees alike are required to wear masks in our facilities. Uh, we've got, we're alternating every other point of sale. And then there's a plexiglass barrier between the employee and the guest. We're sanitizing every occupied seat between every single showtime with a CDC approved spray. B&B theaters asking patrons to use credit cards. And what's kind of neat is weirdly our ticketing software has a feature where if you purchase a ticket online, it can automatically block off the adjacent seats. And so you can still sit next to the people you come with, but don't have to worry about how close you are to other people. And each patron has a two seat space between them. It, we really have, I think, addressed virtually every concern out there. Very much welcome feedback though from our guests. We want to make sure that we're doing everything we can to make sure they feel safe and comfortable and excited to come back. Well, the first show began here at the Wildwood B&B Theater at 4 p.m. today. Masks are required for everyone. In Wildwood, Patrick Clark, Fox 2 News.